Uh, this is an ode for our healing garden uh, by Leah Johnson, founding member and past president, Friends of the Child Advocacy Center. Uh, images, memories flood our minds, bruises, broken bones, innocent lives lost, to maltreatment, sickness, tragedy. Endeavors to amend their lot in life, bring healing, and keep the promise of a safe childhood unexpectedly become disrupted by forces beyond our control. The trauma of abuse leaves behind a weight of sadness, disappointment, feelings of betrayal. Maltreatment and immoral blemish leaves a residue to purge from consciousness. This healing garden we dedicate today is a place to come and find healing. Release the sorrow that is within you. Your tears, a bountiful rain for seeds to sprout. Uplift your heart and spirit. Find renewed strength. Remember those who are hurting or have lost their lives. Bolster your mind to find meaning by turning the experience into good. Develop compassion and empathy for others who will need you. And listen for the slightest whisper of a hurting child and respond to change the future. And so this here is the Healing Garden at Bedina Mass Park, established 2015. And the Healing Garden, remembering the victims of child abuse, dedicated to the healing of survivors, sponsored by the Friends of the Child Advocacy Center. And so I'll just give it a quick... So there you go.